Good morning, I'm uh, Valerio Marzaioli and I'm here to present uh, our project. The project was born in the closest uh, actuality. In fact, uh, the PNRR, a national plan to repay the damage caused by the global pandemic, allows uh, access to substantial funds to be able to invest in uh, renewables. In addition, the search for alternative energy became more pressing after the outbreak of the Russian-Ukrainian conflict. The central idea was to search uh, for the use of layers about uh, the legislative constraints on the territory for areas available for the installation of large-scale photovoltaic and wind power plants in the Lazio region. In Italy, the central state has delegated to the regions the task of identifying areas suitable for the installation of such facilities. The Lazio region has in turn delegated the task to individual municipalities, which have not yet done so. So the main regulation we have to deal with are the renewable degree of 2021 and for the Lazio region the PTPR Territorial Regional Landscape Plan. The layers were provided by the region's uh, geo website and employed in QGIS uh, version 3.16. From an initial estimate, uh, it was noted that uh, for the region the most productive alternative energy is photovoltaic. In Italy, large photovoltaic is considered to be the system that exceeds uh, 1 megawatt if installed on buildings and uh, 200 kilowatt per hour if installed on the ground. The more than um, 50 layers employed delineated areas definitely not available for installation and brought out uh, those to be considered suitable but with limitation. The layer containing areas uh, designated for landfills and quarries was then added to this map. The resulting map has, uh, is as follows. We can see in grey unsuitable areas, uh, in red uh, municipalities, landfills in green and uh, quarries in uh, yellow. Two rough uh, estimates of the region's possible energy expenditure in terms of domestic use and all-electric uh, private traction were then added to this uh, spatial analysis. The estimates were uh, derived using uh, data about the number of cars present and kilometers driven by each inhabitant in the region from ACI, uh, Italian National Car Association, and the average consumption of the Lazio citizen from Terna S.P.A., an Italian company operating electricity transmission networks. These were combined with the rough estimates of the yield per square meter of a photovoltaic system under the best possible condition. Data obtained through um, the use of the EU software photovoltaic geographical information system, uh, version 5.2. Analyzing the estimates derived, it appears that most municipalities could be energy self-sufficient by allocating available areas with limitation to the installation of photovoltaics. It should be noted, uh, however, that the areas taken into consideration are most likely to be greatly reduced. Among them, for example, the Fiumicino Airport emerges as an available uh, area. And then the estimates made here are largely approximate. It is probably for this reason that the central state and the regions have delegated to the municipalities, which are closer and more familiar with the territory, the identification of areas that can be allocated for this purpose, also pushing on their reuse and re-evaluating certain constraints. Thank you for your attention. Thanks to the presenter, Valerio Marzaioli and Valerio Baiocchi, for this video. And, uh...